News tonight is a serious ATV crash in Jacksonville's Newtown neighborhood. It sent one person to the hospital in critical condition. News for Jackson told that person riding the ATV has life-threatening injuries. The crash was at Powhatan Street and West First Street in Newtown. It's a residential area not far from some major roadways. News for Jackson reporter Eric Avenier is joining us live. Eric, how did this happen? Yeah, well, this, according to neighbors, that it, it, this may have happened when one vehicle did not stop at a stop sign. Now, I would say shortly after about 9 o'clock tonight, uh, Jacksonville police started to uh, clear the scene, which, as you can see, is clear right now. And after wrapping up their preliminary investigation, let's go ahead and roll some of that video from when we arrived at around 830 tonight. There you'll see an ATV sitting in a grassy lot in that car, and the car that hit the ATV still at the scene. A neighbor who didn't want to go on camera says he was outside when he saw the driver of the ATV run the stop sign at First Street and Powhatan Street, then get hit by an oncoming white Chevy Impala. He says it appeared the driver of the Impala could not stop in time to prevent hitting that ATV. The driver of the ATV was taken to the hospital in critical condition. Now, according to state law, it's illegal to operate an ATV on a public street because they were not designed to be used off road. Operating an ATV on Jacksonville city streets is considered a non criminal infraction which means the driver of the ATV could receive a traffic citation once the driver leaves the hospital. Back here live, it is also worth mentioning that the driver of that white Chevy Impala was not harmed in all of this. Reporting live, Eric Avignet, Channel 4, The Local Station.